I want Nigerians to be fair to this administration. They should reflect seriously at the time we came in, especially relative to Northeast and South-South, where we are now. Nigeria's President Muhammadu Buhari says the West African country will soon have special court of law to try corruption and corruption-related cases in order to speed up trial processes. Fighting corruption was one of the three major campaign promises of Mr. Buhari while campaigning for his first time in 2015. In a national address, Mr. Buhari restated his belief in special court to fight corruption in Nigeria. Faced with widespread criticism over concerns that his administration's anti-corruption campaign was not effective, Nigerian President Muhammad Buhari explained that it is not easy to fight corruption under a democratic government. Well, under this system is difficult because if you follow the legal system we inherited from our colonial masters, cases take five, ten years, and people forget. But if you have sufficient courts, You develop terms of reference for them. You bring charges. Immediately, people are put before that court. They will come and uh, defend themselves. But if you go through the system, especially if they still have some savings somewhere, they can get first-class sons, lawyers, to come and defend them. And uh, the case will drag on until maybe Either the judge dies or the committee got tired and they go back to their normal life. That's why I say sufficient courts are very important, especially in the cases of corruption, so that uh, uh, the right act will be properly read uh, to the public, that uh, anybody who finds himself in a place of responsibility and misbehave, he will account for it. We shouldn't wait until uh, people die and go before Almighty God. Buari observed that during his term as a military head of state, he was able to arrest and jail corrupt public officials. He, however, noted that it was not possible to do the same in a democratic regime. The president further expressed optimism that the country will overcome its current challenges. He stated that the country had in the last two years witnessed and overcome a good number of problems that would have destroyed other nations, especially in the aspect of collective security. Reporting from Nigeria, Kamil Sadiq, CBA TV.